In today's video we are going to talk about, frenulum tear during sexual intercourse. Tearing the frenulum of the penis is a common problem that particularly happens when the frenulum is short. It often tears after the first time you have sex, causing bleeding and intense pain near the glands penis. If your frenulum tears, it's important to stop any bleeding by applying direct pressure with sterile gauze or a clean cloth. Tears most commonly happen when the penis is erect, when there is a higher concentration of blood in the area, and therefore it can take up to 20 minutes for bleeding to stop. In most cases, no type of treatment is necessary, as the tissue regenerates and heals on its own after a few days. However, it is recommended to avoid sex while the frenulum is healing, and to maintain good hygiene in the location to prevent future infections. To ensure the frenulum heals quickly without complications, you should consider the following steps. Avoid trauma to the area, therefore avoid any contact sports with a high risk for injury, like football. Avoid sexual intercourse for 3 to 7 days until healing is complete. Wash the genitals after urinating. Apply an over-the-counter cream that promotes healing, this can be applied 2 to 3 times a day, such as pseudocram, aquaphor. When signs of infection emerge, like pain swelling or redness, you should see your doctor or urologist to start treatment with antibiotic ointment. How to prevent tearing? The best way to prevent a tear in the frenulum is to initiate sex gently, to see whether stretching of the frenulum causes pain. Using a lubricant may also help as it prevents excess friction and pulling of the skin. If you notice that your frenulum is very short and that it causes discomfort, you can speak to your urologist about whether you are a good candidate for a frenuloplasty. This is a minor surgical procedure which involves a small cut to the frenulum to lengthen it during intercourse. If you have any question, please leave a comment.